What's going on everyone? It's Asil Suede and in this video I'm going to be showing you all my fat loss diet and my cutting meal plan meal by meal Step by step. I'm gonna be showing you all exactly how I meal prep all of these meals for this fat loss diet Exactly how I cook every single one of these meals There's going to be absolutely no questions left unanswered and I can promise you that this is going to be the easiest fat loss diet video that you will ever find on YouTube guys there's gonna be absolutely no confusion and no complications anybody can follow this diet in order to lose fat get shredded get ripped and get into the best shape of your life anyways I don't want to waste your time I want to get right into the video and show you guys my epic fat loss diet <music> So this fat loss diet and cutting meal plan is going to be centered around three different meals. Now all you need to do is sit back, watch the whole video from start to finish, step by step. I'm going to be showing you all exactly how to cook prepare and meal prep these three different meals that I made sure to keep super, super simple and time efficient for every single one of you. Anybody can make these three meals that I'm about to show you all for this fat loss diet. It is not only super time efficient, but also these three meals are gonna consist of the best fat burning foods, the foods that are going to have you perform at the most efficient, beneficial way possible, and you're gonna feel very full and satisfied with this cutting meal plan. But anyway, I have got all of the ingredients laid out out here from start to finish in order. We've got three different food sources that we're gonna focus on for this cutting meal plan and fat loss diet. Number one is going to be our carb sources. Number two is gonna be our protein sources. And the third source is going to be our fat. So check it out. Again, we have it all in order. Now again, I want you all to sit down and have a pen and paper out there so you can write down all the ingredients you need for this meal plan. It's super simple, you can get them anywhere. And it's also going to be super cheap and budget friendly for you all. So number Number one over here have our vegetables which is going to consist of some mushrooms zucchini and onion and then we also have our broccoli and then some mixed frozen vegetable medley now we are going to move on to some fruit so we have strawberries for this cutting meal plan and then we also have for the rest of our carb sources some white rice some sweet potatoes and then we have oatmeal. These are quick one minute oats, by the way. I'm always looking for the most convenient ingredients that's gonna cook the quickest. So we are gonna move on to our proteins now, guys. We have some whole eggs. We have some egg makers, or otherwise known as cartoned egg beaters, just so it's a lot more efficient in terms of cracking separate eggs for the whites. We have some 93.7 lean ground beef. We've got some boneless, skinless chicken breast right over here. And then we are gonna finish off with a third source, which is gonna be our fats, guys. We have some peanut butter, and then we've also got some avocados. So this is everything you are going to need for this fat loss diet and cutting meal plan. Again, it is going to be super cheap, budget friendly, anybody can buy these foods, anybody can consume them, and it is going to be extremely quick to meal prep. I'm gonna show you guys exactly how I do that. So this cutting diet is going to be super beneficial and efficient due to the fact that you know exactly how many calories and how many carbs, fats, and proteins you are consuming for this fat loss diet. And in order to properly know this and have that kind of structure, you're going to need one extremely important thing. And this one thing is going to be a food scale. So make sure you get yourself a food scale. You can find this at a local grocery store or simply order it online for around 10 to $15. It's super beneficial when it comes comes to losing fat and for this fat loss diet. Okay, so I'm going to start with meal number one in this fat loss diet and cutting meal plan. So check it out, we've got all of our ingredients here for meal number one. We have our vegetables, which is going to be some zucchinis and onion and mushroom. And then we have our carb sources, which is going to consist of the oatmeal and strawberries. And then we also have our proteins, which is going to be some egg makers and some eggs. And then we also have our fat sources, which again is going to be eggs as well, but also the peanut butter. So anyways, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys exactly how I cook meal number one, exactly how I prepare it step by step to show you all how how you can do it as well. Okay, so just some basic things that you're also going to need for this fat loss diet and cutting meal plan are just the simple cooking utensils. You're gonna need an oven to bake with, 
you're gonna need some cooking pans, and then you are also just gonna need your basic cooking utensils here. So I'm sure every single one of you has access to that. So anyways, let's go ahead and get started with uh, meal number one, exactly how I'm gonna prepare that. Okay, so before we prepare anything food-wise, we're gonna go ahead and put a pan right over here, and then we're gonna put this on medium. Okay, so as we have the pan heating up, we're gonna start chopping up our vegetables. So we have our mushrooms all washed up right over here, and we're gonna go ahead and weigh out 100 grams of mushrooms. We have 100 grams here. We're gonna do our zucchini, guys. So again, we're gonna weigh out 100 grams of zucchini. There we go, 100 grams on the dot. And then now we have our onions. So we're gonna put this in a little bit of a scramble, guys. And you want to make sure also you have a cutting board and then just a very sharp knife obviously to cut the vegetables So what we're gonna do is simply weigh out around 50 grams of onions check it out There we have 50 grams and then what we're gonna do is simply just chop up the vegetables guys Okay, so I've got all of my vegetables for meal number one all chopped up and ready to go. Now here's a very important note as well. So we are not going to be cooking any of these meals for this fat loss diet with olive oil or butter as usually people typically like to do. We're gonna be using some cooking spray just to save on on a whole lot of calories, guys. So go ahead and spray up the pan. And by this time, the pan has already been heating, so it's pretty hot enough to cook this quickly. And we're gonna throw in all of our vegetables here. Go ahead and move on to step number two for meal number one of this fat loss diet. So this fat loss diet is all about efficiency, guys. So we're gonna save out on a lot of time. And in order to do so, while the vegetables are cooking up, we're gonna go ahead, zero out the scale, put our bowl, and start putting in our oatmeal in the microwave. So what we're gonna do is measure out 80 grams of dried oats. And I personally like to use the quick one minute oatmeal, by the way, you can use rolled oats or steel cut oatmeal. It's all the same in terms of uh, the calories and macronutrients. However, these cook the fastest. So again, we're trying to save as much time as possible just so we can stick to this diet long term, right? Because nobody wants to spend an hour in kitchen every single day. Believe me, whether you like fitness or not, I don't like to do that. I'm sure you don't either. Okay, so now we are simply going to put about a cup of water with our 80 grams of cooked oats and now it's time to nuke it in the microwave for three minutes. Remember guys, don't just let your vegetables sit on the pan. They're gonna become all sticky and it's just gonna over burn one side of the vegetable. So be sure you're moving them around and uh, yeah, do your best to kind of pay attention to multitask here. Okay, so now we're gonna move on to the next step for meal number one of the fat loss diet. So check it out, we are gonna set up our protein sources now. So after we have again used another bowl to put on the scale and zeroed it out, we are gonna weigh out six egg whites or six egg beaters. So each one egg white is 46 grams. So 46 times six, I think I did the math right there. It's gonna be 276 grams. We're gonna go ahead and weigh the six egg whites out. There you have it, 276 grams. So we are then going to crack two whole eggs and mix them in with our egg beaters because we do want some fats as well. We're just saving out on the fats by having the egg whites because it's gonna increase the protein but keep the fats at around the same with just the whole eggs. All right, so there we have it. We have our two whole eggs and six egg whites all mixed up. So now what we're gonna do is mix it in with the vegetables that are cooking up on the pan for a few minutes now. Oh, check it out. We've also got the oatmeal that just conveniently finished up at the same time. Again, time efficiency with this fat loss diet. Okay, so these vegetables are all browned out. So what we're gonna do is put the egg whites and the eggs right on top. And that is going to make for a delicious egg scramble, guys. Super high in protein and very filling with the vegetables. Okay, so I've got my cooked oats out of the microwave. I'm just gonna do a few simple things to make this taste a whole lot better because nobody likes some plain bland oats. So what I'm gonna do first is put a little bit of sea salt, just a tiny bit, 
just to give it a little of that savory taste. And then what I'm also gonna do is put a spoon full of artificial sweetener, just like stevia, something natural, something that you personally enjoy. And then after I do that, I'm gonna mix it up just for a little bit, guys. You know, not too much because we are gonna mix it in just a moment as well. Okay, now this is very important. We have our natural peanut butter right on the weight scale here. So what we're gonna do is open the jar, put it right back on the weight scale, zero it out, and then we're gonna weigh out one tablespoon, which if you look on the back is gonna be 16 grams worth of peanut butter here. So 16 grams there, perfect, right on the dot. And we're gonna mix it in with our cooked oats. The peanut butter is essentially gonna just melt right in. It's gonna taste absolutely delicious, guys. You have the salt, you have the sweetness from the uh, artificial sweetener, and then you have that like savory peanut butter flavor from the peanut butter, of course. So this is gonna make your oats taste a whole lot better. Okay, so we have got the vegetables and the eggs all cooked up. So we're gonna go ahead and turn off the pan. And then what I personally like to do as well after the eggs are done cooking is go ahead and put on my seasoning. So I just like keeping it simple, guys. I'm gonna use some salt and cracked black pepper. Perfect, so now they're gonna taste absolutely delicious. Let's go ahead and put these suckers on a plate. Okay guys, so we are almost done here. We have our cooked eggs on a plate, which looks absolutely phenomenal. And then we also have our peanut butter oatmeal, but we're not done with the oatmeal just yet. We're gonna go ahead and add in some fruit inside the oatmeal to not only give it a much better, sweeter flavor, but also to increase the carbohydrates in this meal as well. So check it out. We're gonna put 100 grams of strawberries and I like dicing them small pieces just so it's like mixed in with the oatmeal perfectly. I just really, really enjoy that guys. So just a little tip there. All right, so we have meal number one all prepped up and completed in under 10 minutes time. So check it out, we have six egg whites, two whole eggs, and then we have the zucchini, onions, and mushrooms. And we also have the peanut butter oatmeal with 100 grams of strawberries on top. Now, meal number one, total calories and macros are gonna consist of 776 calories, coming from 77 grams of carbs, 24 grams of fat, and 62 grams of protein. So this is gonna be a very heavy meal that's gonna fill you up, guys, full of healthy, micronutrient-dense foods. You have a lot of vegetables, a lot of fruit, and in general, very wholesome filling carbohydrate sources and protein sources as well from the eggs and the egg whites. Now, when it comes to timing and when to eat this meal and your first meal of the day in general, because it is meal number one, you have two different options. You can either start off with breakfast and have this be your big meal of the day so you're filled up for the next few hours and don't have to eat till past lunchtime or around 2 to 3 p.m. Or you have another option, which is what I like to personally participate in, which is something called intermittent fasting, where you don't eat anything for the first four to six hours of your day, and then you finally break your fast with meal number one, which is exactly how I showed you all. I showed you how to prep it, how to make it, how to create it, and in general, exactly step-by-step step how to do so yourself. Anybody can do this, guys. Anyways, we're gonna go ahead, move on to meal number two. I really hope you all are enjoying this step-by-step -step video. I know that nobody else shows you guys exactly how to do this in the most time-effective manner like I am, so please be sure to drop a like on this video right now if you do genuinely appreciate it it would mean a lot to me So now I'm going to be moving on to meal number two in this fat loss diet and cutting meal plan. So check it out, we have the ingredients all laid out here for meal number two. We have our boneless, skinless chicken breast right over here. And then we also have some sweet potatoes, some avocados, and then we've also got some broccoli for our veggies. Now, this meal is gonna require a little bit of meal prepping to set you up for success long-term. I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to do that just so you have the same meal prepared and ready to go for the entire week, just so you don't have to keep cooking it. So I'm gonna go ahead and meal prep this boneless, skinless chicken breast, and I definitely advise you all to do so as well. I'm gonna show you all exactly how to do this in order to be successful long-term and have chicken ready to go in the fridge for the entire week. So 
check it out guys. This is going to be a very quick process. It's not gonna get, be complicating. So we have our boneless skinless chicken breast right here in the pot. And what we're gonna do first is spray some cooking spray on a baking sheet, right? And then you also wanna make sure you have your oven preheating for the first 10 minutes on 425. And as soon as that's ready to go, we're gonna go ahead and first put all of our chicken breast on the oven tray and then we're gonna put it inside. Now a little tip here guys, when you have three big pieces of boneless skinless chicken breast on the uh, baking tray, you wanna go ahead and get a sharp knife and just cut these in half because if you cook them and put them in the oven when they're just one whole big breast, it's gonna take forever to cook, I promise you that. So when you cook them in half, you essentially have two pieces of chicken breast and each piece is gonna be around six to eight ounces or so. So it's gonna be perfect for meal prepping. Okay, so we've got the chicken all laid out on the pan, again, all cut in half. Then we're also going to now put some seasoning. So we have some garlic salt right over here. We're gonna go ahead and just put it all on top of the chicken. Don't worry too much about the sodium, guys. At the end of the day, if you're drinking enough water, which I will talk about that later in the video, you're gonna be just fine. So we got the garlic salt on top, and then now I'm gonna add some crushed black pepper. So now that we've got the chicken breast all seasoned up and ready to go, we're gonna put it in the oven for around 30 minutes, depending on your oven, and just really keep checking on it, guys. Okay, so now while we wait for the chicken to bake in the oven, we're gonna go ahead and prepare the rest of the food for meal number two. So we're gonna start with the sweet potato and check it out. What we're gonna do first is wash and clean up the sweet potato. So after I've cleaned up the sweet potato, I wanna show you all some secret tips on exactly how you can cook sweet potatoes and potatoes in general a lot faster and just have it be a lot more efficient. So check it out. I have a knife right here, make sure it's pretty sharp. And then what I like to do is just poke holes on the sweet potato. Now you wanna make sure you're careful here. You don't wanna stab your finger or stab yourself in the hand. Okay, so after you have poked some deep holes into the sweet potato, what you wanna do now is get yourself a paper towel and then just give it a good rinse with some water. Make sure it is pretty wet. And then what you're gonna do, wrap it around the sweet potato. So the holes on the sweet potato is just gonna make it cook all the way through a lot quicker. And then also the paper towel, I don't know, this is just like a magic trick. I've learned this a long time ago and it really does help it cook a lot quicker. So let's go ahead and nuke this in the microwave. All right, so the sweet potato is all done cooking up in the microwave. Now watch out when you're taking it out, it's pretty hot. Unravel it from its little blanket, and bam, you've got yourself a cooked sweet potato in just about five minutes, guys. And then we're also gonna go ahead and put this sucker in for three minutes now for our vegetable for meal number two. Now check it out. You can freshly cook some steamed broccoli, boil it in a pot. However, this is honestly so much more convenient. And again, this meal plan and this fat loss diet is all about time efficiency in order to stay consistent on it. So what I personally like doing is getting some steamable vegetables. So steamable in a bag broccoli is exactly what we're gonna do here. Gonna go ahead and poke some holes into it and then nuke it in the microwave for three minutes. So I've got meal number two all prepped up and ready to be assembled. So check it out, we have our cooked boneless skinless chicken breast which is actually gonna be plenty and we have enough for the entire week of meal prep for this fat loss diet guys so it's absolutely perfect and then we also have some avocado for our fats we have the sweet potato that I showed you all exactly how to cook in the most convenient way for our carb source also of course have our vegetables which is gonna be some broccoli which was also very conveniently cooked in a time efficient manner so check it out we have our food scale and what I'm gonna do is go ahead and weigh out all of my foods all right So I've 
got meal number two in this fat loss diet and cutting meal plan fully assembled on the plate. What I've got is eight ounces of cooked boneless skinless chicken breast, 75 grams of avocado, 170 grams of steamed broccoli, and 200 grams of sweet potato. Now, meal number two in today's fat loss diet is gonna consist of 680 calories coming from 55 grams of carbs, 19 grams of fat, and 66 grams of protein. So I want you all to notice in today's fat loss diet and cutting meal plan, we are not having six tiny meals where we're essentially just teasing ourselves towards the next meal. You guys are gonna notice, again, meal number two is gonna consist of nothing but wholesome, healthy, micronutrient dense filling foods that are gonna leave you feeling super full and satisfied, which is gonna leave you being very uh, consistent and successful in your long-term dieting phase, which is always the goal, guys. So when it comes to meal timing here, I would definitely recommend a few hours between meal number one when you eat this because you are gonna be very full and you don't wanna be uh, feeling a little bit hefty and bloated. So anyways, meal number two is a success. We're gonna go ahead and move on to meal number three in just a moment. So I've got all the ingredients needed for meal number three in this fat loss diet. And what it's gonna consist of is some pre-prepared white rice. So this has just been cooked in bulk. And then we also have some 93.7 lean ground beef, which I'm about to show you all exactly how I prepare this in bulk, just like my boneless skinless chicken breast. So I have it ready for the rest of the week for all of the meals needed for this cutting diet. And then we also have some mixed vegetables, which again, I'm gonna show you all exactly how to cook. So let's go ahead and begin preparing meal number three. So first off, I'm gonna be preparing the ground beef for meal number three. So first off, you're gonna make sure you preheat a cooking pan, and then after that, you're gonna grab your cooking spray once again, and then go ahead and spray this pan. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna toss all of this 93.7 lean ground beef in the pan and cook it in bulk, guys. There's absolutely no reason for me just to cook a serving or two for meal number three when it takes the same amount of time versus cooking the entire thing for the rest of the week. So this is gonna be around three pounds of lean ground beef but again guys it's gonna be enough for meal number three in this cutting diet for the rest of the week so you're gonna have to keep spending time cooking and that's the whole goal So now it's time to prepare the vegetables and this is a really easy one, guys. So because this is frozen, all we're gonna have to do is just put some in a bowl, just like so. And then we are gonna fill this up with some water right over here. And we're simply gonna nuke it in the microwave. Now mixed vegetables are honestly my favorite just because you get a lot of variety with what you're eating. And uh, again, it's just super convenient to cook. So it's been just under 15 minutes. We've got the rice on the plate, the ground beef is done cooking up, and the mixed vegetables are done cooking the microwave as well. So let's go ahead and set up meal number three. So I have meal number three in this fat loss diet all prepped up and put on a plate. I've got six ounces of 93.7 lean ground beef, 88 grams of mixed vegetables, which is one serving, and 200 grams of white rice. So that is going to be meal number three, and this is going to consist of 650 calories coming from 68 grams of carbs, 17 grams of fat, and 52 grams of protein. So that is going to be the last and final meal in today's fat loss diet and cutting meal plan. However, there's one very important step that I have to mention you all once you're done cooking this meal. So let's get right to it. So this step is going to be extremely important, guys. Once you are done cooking all three meals, now you wanna move on to meal prep with all the food that's left, which is most likely going to be your protein. So we have our baked boneless skinless chicken breast right over here on the oven tray that we did not forget about, along with our 93.7 lean ground beef. Now, I recommend just getting some meal prep containers. You could buy these for like less than 50 cents a container at Walmart or at your nearest grocery store or online, whatever it best prefers yourself. However, you wanna make Make sure you just meal prep this, save it in the fridge, and just have it for the rest of the week so you don't have to spend any time cooking just like we did today. So you always wanna prepare and set yourself up for success when it comes to this fat loss diet and this cutting meal plan.
So there you have it. I showed you all my fat loss diet and cutting meal plan, meal by meal, step by step, and I showed you all exactly how to meal prep and how to cook every single one of these meals. So the total calories and macros of this fat loss diet and cutting meal plan is going to be 2,111 calories coming from 200 grams of carbs, 60 grams of fat, and 180 grams of protein. Now this cutting diet is going to be perfect for your fat loss goals, and summer is right around the corner, guys. I want every single one of you to feel confident with your top off. I want every single one of you to look in the mirror and be happy with what you see. I want you all to look in the mirror and see that ripped, muscular, well-developed, lean six-pack physique that you've always wanted. So for a limited time only, guys, I created a free three-step program. Now, this three-step program is gonna include step number one, a weight training program that is completely designed with this meal plan, so it's gonna completely be tailored towards this as well, so you can use both. And then step number two is going to be a free cardio program, again, all tailored to have you achieve that ripped, lean, muscular physique. And then step number three is also going Going to be another free diet program. Again, this is for a limited time only. If you want to get access to this limited time free three-step program, all you have to do is click the first link in the description box down below. And then once you click that link, you'll be taken to another website and you simply plug in your email and I will be sending you this free three-step program. And I promise you, you will be achieving the best results of your life. You're finally gonna be able to take your shirt off and feel confident. You're finally gonna be able to achieve results every single day. None of it is going to be a guess game anymore. You're gonna have a complete free plan, again, that I'm only giving out for a limited time only. So please guys, click that first link in the description box down below. You have absolutely nothing to lose and I would hate for you all to just waste this opportunity. Anyways, if you all want to see more free meal plans when it comes to losing fat and more in general meal prep videos to know exactly how you can cook your meals along with more healthy meal recipes and ideas. All you have to do is just be sure to give this video a like and share it with a friend or two if you really liked it. Thank you all so much for watching guys. If you are new to the channel, please be sure to hit that subscribe button. Hit the notification bell right next to the subscribe button so you're staying in tune with all of my videos. Follow me on Instagram at the seal suede. You're gonna find a lot of helpful fat loss content on there as well. Thank you for watching and I will see every single one of you in the next video.